So here is the main floor room, just finished a few days ago. It's finished for now, but not completely finished because the stairs will be in that opening. And painted and we moved the tape around the uh, edges for the moldings. That's the ceiling. And so here is uh, the stairs opening. Now in this corner I haven't finished it yet because I wasn't sure how it's going to fit with the rest. And the ceiling will come right under there. And also here it's not finished because that big beam has actually moved sideways. So what I have to do is I have to prop this up about one or two centimeters so that and also there's a bolt there that I have to hide. So I have to prop up that thing to put some drywall on top of that. Uh, so these are the windows. And also for the winter, I haven't put them in, but I bought new windows that will come right here and they'll be flush with the windows. Uh, sorry, flush with the walls. So here's the room. Yes, that will be my new storage for my bicycle. And um, the rest of the downstairs, I won't do it until next year. I want to try to finish the upstairs room before it gets cold. So let's go upstairs, I'll show you what I did. So this is the old stairs, you can see it's in the middle of the house now, and very dusty on the sanding of the drywall. <coughs> so here's the other room. I'll go from the other side. So this here will be the new entrance. So I finished the ceiling in there as well and I painted it. And so here we go. So this is where we're going to come in or go down. This will be the access for the attic. I, I left it open for now, but obviously I'm going to close that soon. And here's the window. So here, this is kind of a corner we can't really use. So I built a closet in there. That's going to be very handy. So. Here's going to be the stairs, starting right here. All right. And so this here will extend about two centimeters or so. I have to prop this up. And here's the room. This wall is finished. And this is the corner. So this room here where the stair is there and that will be gone that uh, beam there will stay to support the roof but this one will be gone and from here until the window will be a closet and the window will be gone so the light will come from here and from next door because this here will be open so there'll be a big area right now the hallway is kind of dark even in daytime but uh, this will be a big opening and here so this will be open too once the stair is gone so that will give me a big open space so here's the other room the closet i just keep my tools for now but here's the closet and obviously there's going to be a door, so that's, again, I'm not uh, in a hurry to finish it. It doesn't make the place warmer. So here's the window. So this window will stay, and that will be the top of the stairs. And here, from here, from there to here will be a railing. Keep people from falling down. All right. And so here's the ceiling. And then here... I use the LED light. It's nice. It goes on right away. And then it has different adjustment, three adjustments. And then you can't see it, it's daytime, but there's a little bit light there. Then it's off. It's really quick. Unlike the other light.
So here's the room. And so the closet will be at this spot. So from here, the next room will be a closet. And I think I will leave the back open. Uh, it's kind of a common area, so we can just leave it open. So here's the ceiling. Right. So let's go back this way. So we're gonna come here from the stairs down, go up here and in here and into this hallway. And there will be a, an extra bathroom at the end of the hallway as well. So, <clears throat> so next room I will do is this room here. Now a laundry room, but laundry room will go to that room. So here. It's finished. 